There it is. Blue circle. Blue, blue circle. Don't care about any of your messages. <clears throat> Let's go ahead and continue. We are hungry and thirsty, but that was one of the reasons I stopped last time. Then it was also super late. Let's continue the game with our selected avatar. More desert Look. fun time, baby. Psst, yep, more desert nothing. Basically wanted to, let's see, to try, well, yes. When you end an expedition, return to base camp. Any material you obtain are automatically sent to the storehouse. Sure. Items can be discarded at the inventory screen. <laughs> Excuse me. Once discarded, items cannot be recovered. So don't discard items. Let's resume the game. We should have some sign-in bonus. The predicted location. Some grenades, some clean water, some rations. Rations? And Molotovs. What uh, orders do we have? I have to use bows. Gather stainless steel. I'll accept the quest of open containers, because if we complete any of these other quests, we'll accomplish that quest. I don't know if I'm going to find any stainless steel or sex appeal out there, but uh, we can certainly try. Take the weekly challenge of gathering animal leather. Okay. I don't suppose we have any cases. No, that would have been too easy. <laughs> Let's go into our inventory here. Got a campfire here. Let's go ahead and cook up some grilled sheep. Start some grilled Nubians. I only had one. Hmm, okay, I thought I'd managed to take more meat than that, but uh, okay. Oh, we have some spoiled Nubian meat. Let's discard all of our spoiled meat. We uh, really enjoyed that. Okay, that's well, all good. Well, that was orgasmic. Yeah, no, we love that. We we love eating. I mean, we're pretty into, uh, we're pretty into drinking, but eating, oh my god. Let's, uh, fix up our tank here. Okay. Our pipe spear is doing just fine. Well, it's at 77%. We'll stick with that for now, though. Let's see, and... We had just gotten a mission about this, yeah, this crashed helicopter, right? Yes, we did. There's an inactive wormhole transporter detected over there. This is going to be a whole thing, but uh, let's see what we can do. Let's see if we can take that wormhole transporter over to the wormhole. Well, actually, let me see if I can level up. We get classier, like Freddy Blassier. Let 
Now we don't have any skill points. So, yeah. Let's get out of here. That's pretty much the only other transporter we can go to. I don't even know that that actually saves us any time. But uh, let's try and get over here. I don't suppose my wrecked up Jeep is out here still anywhere, is it? No, that's too bad. Oh, that place that I could see off in the distance, it's getting harder to see because of all of the dust. Um, what? Hey, pal, don't worry about it. Yep. That's me. I'm an enemy. really seemed more disappointed by the fact that I was messing with his buddy. He just ran over to check on him. These wanderers have a real strong sense of community, you know? Strong communal bonds. Now then. You look like you're dead. Yet I bet you're not. There you go. Cuban energy time. You, are you another guy who's not really dead? even there. Alright, let's get over to this helicopter site. Cuban energy? Aren't those cigars? It's Cubone energy. It's uh, the energy that uh, you get from mourning over your mother. Sliding down here. Life form detected at helicopter crash site. I've also identified multiple wanderers. Approach with caution. Oh darn. That really goes against my old philosophy, you know. If I have to, I guess. Well, there's your old crash site. I hope there's a box in there, but uh, I kind of don't want to mess with it right now because I got to find this person. XOF. There we go. Time for more stare down token.
time for a super pokes down. Oh, that one's a real climber, huh? Okay, that's all you guys. Well, time to uh, go into a long cycle of garnering Kuban energy from a bunch of randos. mean, I guess it is a big net gain of Cuban energy. It's just going to take us a while to uh, sort of make our way through it. Meanwhile, we're getting so thirsty. Thirstier than I am hungry, but uh, good note. I don't know how I'm supposed to eat with all of the dust around, but uh, you know, okay. Set the target right here for a second. Got any more wanderers over here? Hello, nurse. Hello. Yeah, it doesn't do extended bells at all. You're absolutely right. Hello, nurse. Come back and collect up goodies later. It's like, what? You mess with my friend. It did. By a couple points right there. I should also uh, fix up more oxygen by using cubo and energy and uh, whatever all else you guys can think of for me to do in order to, you know, Metal Gear survive. Alright. So I cleared out a couple of guys over here. That person is not doing great. So let's get back here real quick. Make sure, for one, nobody's messing with her. I think it's just that, uh... <clears throat> Alright, fireman's carry. You're nearly out of oxygen. I absolutely am. Alright. That's your favorite. My phone needs charging DX. Oh, okay. You can charge G-Generation X phone. 
There are probably still some more zombies up here, so I need to be somewhat mindful. Or maybe there are none left. Well, let's see what we have to do here. It may be that we've taken care of everybody on our way over. place a fence down here just in case there is anybody coming. Just to really mess with them, you know? You were it. I'm... I'm okay with that. Maybe I should be a little more careful around the... Well, I dropped you unceremoniously, but let's get you back. And, uh... Use this dang-dong wormhole transporter. Wait, no. There, yeah. Take us back to base camp. Silly. <clears throat> All right. Very gentle fireman's carry slam. You sure breathed that dust for a long time. You sure you're okay? Thank you. That helped. <laughs> Being dropped helped. What's your name? The nurse trophy. What, what, what's your name? What's the deal with that? Miranda. Hey, I'm Miranda. I'm from Space Australia. Oh, yeah. I remember. It was just like any other night. I was out on a call with the doctor when we lost contact with the hospital. The we doctor? As fast as we could, but the hospital was on fire. Oh, well, you shouldn't have driven back so fast. <laughs> you could have come back and, uh, it would have been out. And if that wasn't hard enough to believe, a moment later, there was a light in the sky. It sucked our ambulance into it with us in it. Somehow, we survived, but then the doctor started acting strangely. <laughs> Saying it out loud, it all sounds so ridiculous. Like any of that actually happened, right? No, I'm 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 sure that you're not where you are right now. And where all of us are in this weird vision of hell, detail, landscape, desert. Also, it's actually technically heaven because we have to use a digger to get down to our world. No, what you experienced actually happened. I saw the same thing in the sky. And I was here. Just like you. Where is here? We call it DT for some reason. They call it DT. To put it simply, it's a world in another dimension. A world destroyed by some unknown parasite. Wait. Unknown parasite? So when the doctor looked different and attacked me after we got here. Yeah, looked different. That's what we're gonna say. Um also, is this picture supposed to be a picture of the doctor? Yeah. <laughs> we call humans that get infected by it wanderers. And there's no cure? Apparently not. Once you end up like that, you're just a living corpse. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> what's all? What's that about? I mean, it's a corpse. How's it live? What's the deal? Only thing you can do for him is kill him. That goes for your friends, too. Wanderers and your friends. The only thing you can do for them is to kill them. You're sure about that? You guys don't look like doctors to me. Maybe a team of specialists could... Yeah, maybe a team of specialists. Let's get a team of specialists. If 
anyone could have done something about this, this place would still be standing, wouldn't it? Maybe they just lack certain advances in medicine. And like you said, they're still living. Perhaps if we try to communicate with them with a little persistence, we can get through to them. Yeah, Miranda, go out there and talk to the Wanderers. That sounds like a good idea. Look, your ridiculous theories are an insult to every one of them we've had to put down. I'm trying to take some moral high ground <laughs> will do jack squat for you here. If you want to stay alive, keep quiet and do what we tell you. Great, Reeve. I mean, yeah. <laughs> Miranda, your ridiculous theories are an insult to every one of these, these zombies. Quit insulting the zombies. Without morals? We're no different from them. Well, I mean, we have eyes and ears and a top half of our faces. That's a slight difference. Take off your shirt. <sighs> Look. No. What? Okay, yeah, Reeve. You're injured, aren't you? Your breathing is off. Oh my. You might have a fractured rib. I should take a look at you. What are you tear waiting off shirt. for? If you want to stay alive, keep quiet and do what I tell you. Oh, it's a little... It's a turnaround that's a little too fast for it to be extra sneaky. Well, they're totally gonna bone, right? The tension, it's so palpable. Established a base development team. A new crew member has joined. We can fill an empty container of water at watering holes we discover in the field. Yup. Items stored are displayed in a report. Yup. Wormhole extraction. Oh no, we didn't see what it was. To make effective use of our labor source, you should assign crew members to units. Come and assign crew members here. Pay attention to me. Assigning crew members to units will ensure base camp runs more smoothly. Assign crew members as the situation warrants. Okay, so there you go. You can assign the uh, castaways that you rescued as crew. Uh, each team has a rank. Let's keep Abilities depending on how high its rank is. The team's rank is determined based on the number of crew assigned to it and the aptitude of each crew for the team. The aptitude of the crew towards their team depends on their condition and past work history. Try switching up a team's formation if it's not performing to your expectations. Great. So no assignment, base development, and all and needs treatment. Assign crew to increase efficiency of agricultural resources that produce shared resources. Well, we don't have any of that right now, so let's not do any of that. Got anything else to say, Virgil 189? Assign crew to base development team. Fine. Reeve, I'm going to change you to the base development team. Captain, there is one item to report. What is this item? When we scanned the area around the location where you rescued that woman, we detected a new memory board. Can you say that woman like you she's the other woman? To the situation report. Great. Looking forward to it, guys. Alright. Can I go ahead and... Uh, change you back to no assignment? Yeah. I wouldn't care, except I have seen a little bit of how the game works, and... Uh, your uh, your crew members can develop fatigue, and uh, that blows. Anyhow, let's go back to Virgil 189. We've gotten our login bonuses for the day. We went and actually accomplished a plot mission, so we're going to go ahead and save and quit. We uh, we accomplished what we needed to do. It was very efficient, and it'll give us time to go back and check on our fallout shelter. 
because uh, I do want to get, you know, I got an early morning and I was actually planning on being that neighbor who unfortunately ends up doing a little bit of yard work in the morning on a weekend. It's the only time I've got to do it. No, I, I, I don't actually want to continue playing right now. 